This is Tracy from Gift Basket Appeal. And today we're gonna take this ribbon and we're gonna paint it. It's a burlap ribbon, but it's too plain. So I wanted to add a little bit of sparkle to it. I'm going to take this wine cork and because it's round, I'm going to dip it in this metallic paint. I'm using one of my favorites. It's the Royal Gold Metallic. And so this should be fun. So all I'm doing is basically using this as a stamp to stamp some circles on this. And this is a great way that you can add something to a somewhat plain ribbon. Super easy. And of course, the more you dip, the more paint that'll come on there. The darker your stamp will be. Just make sure you have some paper under it to protect your surface. And like this one right here didn't come out as good, I can go right back over it. And you can do that for your others also. If you want to just, if you want it even darker, just go right back over it. Super easy. You just have to decide how long you want it to be. For this one, I'm going to actually make a really simple bow out of it to show you what it looks like. So I'm gonna go ahead and let this dry, and then I'll show you the bow that I have in mind. Okay, so now our ribbon is all dry, and I wanted to put it on this surface so you can really see it. So that's just a way to add a little bit of sparkle to your ribbon, and now we're gonna make a bow. This is gonna be a really simple bow. And all I'm doing is folding it. And the other side, you can't really see it as much. So we're just gonna do two folds. I'm gonna fold it and pinch it here. I'm just leaving a little bit out there. And then we're gonna fold this part under and pinch it there. Just wanna make sure that the both sides are even. Now for the part with the chenille stem, which is gonna take this. And this is super easy, because you only have the, the two loops. Okay, I'm just gonna hold it in place like that. And I wanna cover this up. So what I'm going to do is take a little piece of the burlap. I'm just going to fold it over like that. And then I'm going to place it right in the middle there. I'm going to turn this over. I'm just going to move my chenille stem to the side. Folding it over, and right here I'm going to put a little dot of glue, and just be careful with your glue gun. And I still have this folded. I'm just going to wrap this over like that. I just want to hold it down a little bit. 
If you need to add more, you can. But this should hold pretty good. And you can still have your chenille stem to attach it to whatever you want. And there you go. A simple bow, and you just added a little bit of sparkle to it. Who says you can't paint on burlap? So it's no longer plain. Let me show you what the red looks like. Here's a red one I did. Now if you want, you can take these and just use the, the ribbon and just wrap it maybe around a, a wine bottle. Maybe you want to add a little bit of decoration to it, make it a little bit more rustic, or maybe you wrap it around a vase. So those are just a few ideas that you can do with these. But I, I was thinking about this and I said, you know what? Somebody might want to do this. It's super easy to do. So if you have those plain burlap ribbons, go ahead and paint on them. Okay, I hope you like this really short tutorial. Thank you so much for joining me once again. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and subscribe, like, and comment. Thanks for joining me. Bye.